Hello, can you hear me? Okay. Hello. Hello. Yeah. How are you? Yes, I'm fine. And you? Yeah, I am fine. Thank you. Okay, for joining. Okay, so basically you face some problem regarding our online yes. training program issues. So I will try to explain all of those things one by one. So I hope you can easily get the idea and also get the solution about that. Okay. So let's go. So, okay. So first of all, I just okay. Okay, I already opened your port. Just simply share your my screen. Okay. Let me share my screen. Yeah, I share my I share I share from my side. Okay. Okay. So now, can you see my screen? Yes, I'm seeing. Okay. So, okay. so in this time, first of all, we try to discuss about that uh, your problem for making the time three chart. Okay. So in this time, we are just make this time three chart using the Landsat eight satellite imagery for uh, LST or land surface temperature. So you already write the code about that very well. No problem. In this time, you just make a mistake in here. So in this time here, you can see uh, it show about that this type of problem LST vegetation is not defined so in this time we are just make a you just make a function okay it will be in in here and it is start from here you can see it will be start from the parenthesis in here okay so in this function we are just you will just make the name about the add and dvi add bands put the function and put the element name is the bands okay so in this time okay in the all of those things you need to handle using the same element name okay suppose you put at the band so further you can simply copy it and then use the same name yes. also in here okay bands normalize difference put the band name srb5 srb4 calculating the ndvi okay after that okay. this time we are just doing for that okay it's also okay no problem you find out the value from the ndvi mean okay. and also find out the value for ndvi mix okay it also no problem about that and further calculated the fractional vegetation it also okay no problem uh, and you also try okay. to calculate it the emissivity from here emissivity simply calculate and for the thermal okay in this time you can just put here your band element name band. bands yeah uh, then okay. select all of those things then put here the lst and you can see thermal in this time it already define you thermal in here so you can easily use the thermal no problem and then simply bands add bands your this variable lst okay then it's done okay, okay. NDVI not need about that because in this time we are just make the LST set for uh, LST not NDVI okay? not it. so further this okay. function I need to add in my image collection this is my image collection you created but when you put here the median function then it's not a image collection it's just a median single image okay so in this time we are not use the median and clip function because when I make the median it's not a collection it's just a single image okay. single image so in this time I'm simply commenting these things and also use the map function and call the function variable name okay add bands and function variable name what you can put you can see add bands okay same function variable name you can put in here also and further um we are just uh suppose in this time it not need and it also not need suppose i just simply print i simply print about my collection after adding the lsd band so just I simply copy that okay. and copy it and check about my collection what happened then I try to make the chart okay so now click the run again so in this time we can get the LST band is successfully connect with our all of those image collection so now I can see okay. computing Okay, it takes some time, I think. Yeah, for all of the CMS collection, make the add the LST band also. Mm, okay, okay, okay. Thank <laughs> you. 
It takes some time because I think you, because the region is too big. Yes. Okay, just it print the chart also at the same time. And in this time, you just take the geometry. Okay, geometry means your, your, this your point, yeah? The geometry. Yes. Okay, so I'll make the chart for the geometry and then now again. Okay, at the same time, you can get the chart also. Okay. Okay, it's created, you can see. Okay. We can get the 39 okay. image collection in here. And in this time, uh, okay. you can check about the image from the feature. All of this image also added a new band. This band name is the LST. You can see LST. This band is also added in here. So further, we are just uh, okay. call the A line and select our LST band and make our uh, chart for this point. We can get this point, this type of hell we can get from here. Okay, you can see. Okay. Okay. So, for to fix this error because there is there is not a uh, uh, chart is not correct. There is a missing value. Yes. So I can in use time, uh, interpolate. Yeah, you can put here the interpolate nulls in here. After that, then it will be okay. Okay. Then we can get the continuously chart from here. And in this time, it also okay. depends on your image collection. Suppose in this time, we are you can get for the only for the uh, this image collection, 39 image collection. So in this time, suppose you are just also in this time, you can get the one year image collection less than 35. Mm -hmm. So when you want to get the increase your image collection, then we also get the more values. Okay. So in this time, we can get oh, the one okay. image for the January 18. It shows the value for the 40 okay. degrees Celsius. We can get the another image. Uh, 3rd February 41 degrees Celsius. We can get the one image uh, March 43 and get the another image for 38 degrees Celsius March 23. Okay, so when you increase the your okay. image collection, then it will set the more image and we will also get the more values for LST for the different time. Okay, okay, okay. So I will send you this code. You also try to check it from your side. And another problem okay. is that I also check about that. For your L level C using the supervised classification, okay. So this yes. problem is that uh, it's it's a very big region you want to use in here. So in this time we are not able to calculating uh, making the chart, okay. So that's why we need to okay. write the random code. Suppose uh, random code mainly uh, one by one calculate the area for each class. So I think it also covered okay. in our seven number class. I also show you that part. How we can easily calculate it okay. for the single class area. Okay, then you also try to do that. I hope we can easily calculate it the single class area. Or at the same time, all of those class also you can calculate it using the group function. Okay, groups, then you can easily mm -hmm. make the, all of those calculate the area without chart. And unsupervised okay. classification, you also face the problem for the unsupervised classification. In this time, it also same. It, this region is very big. Okay, and in this time, you also okay. try to you are just uh, decrease the number of pixel value. In this time, here I put at the 15,000 pixel value, the number of pixel value, mm -hmm. you try to decrease it. Suppose you try to check for the 1,000, 2,000, 3,000, okay, or, or 20,000, just in, uh, decrease the uh, pixel value and then try to check okay. about that, what is the, you can get. Okay, then for the, any problem, let me know. I also try to discuss about this. Okay. Okay, no, no problem, thank okay. you. Okay, I will send you the code. You also try to practice. Okay. 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 Thank you. Okay. Okay. Have a good day. Okay. Bye. Bye. Thank you.